Christmas. I like the mystery of it. The strange packages hidden under the bed and in little out-of-the-way places. The conversations that stop abruptly when I enter the room. I like being ordered not to buy anything more for myself after the 1st of December because you're so hard to buy anything for. Yes, I like Christmas. And I like to feel that God sets aside these few days near the end of the year so that busy men of business may pause and realize that there are other things in this world besides barter and trade, work and worry, hate, that love and friendship still exist. Yes, I like Christmas. The happy faces of expectant children, the hustle and bustle of the crowds, the millions of dancing lights, the crunch of snow under the feet, the gaily wrapped packages, and the brightly lighted windows. Yes, I like Christmas. I like to look back over the year and silently give thanks for the friends I have known. To give thanks for the inspiration they have been to me. And to know that without them, I could have accomplished so very little. The fact that I have found this world a great place to live in has been due to the thoughtfulness of others. So, I wish you the joy of Christmas, the spirit's sweet repose. I wish you the peace of Christmas to mark the old year's close. I wish you the hope of Christmas to cheer you on your way and a heart of faith and gladness to face each coming day. Yes, I like Christmas. The sun will soon be rising on the morning of another day, the first day of the new year. What can I wish that this day, this year, may bring? Nothing that shall make the world or others poorer, nothing at the expense of other men, but just those few things which in their coming do not stop with me, but touch me rather as they pass and gather strength a few friends who understand me and yet remain my friends, a work to do which has real value without which the world would feel the poorer, a return for such work small enough not to tax unduly anyone who pays. I wish this new year to bring me a mind unafraid to travel even though the trail be not blazed a heart that understands, and in understanding, better able to help you carry your load in life. May I understand the meaning of the tears that sometimes dim your eyes. May I never be the cause of that deep hurt that I've seen in your eyes. May the new year bring a sight of the eternal hills and the unresting sea and of something beautiful the hand of man has made. Bring me also, and this is important, a sense of humor and of power to laugh. A little leisure with nothing to do but spin my dreams when the day is done, and evening descends and cloaks us in her robes of deep velvet. I wish those who are away a speedy and safe return and for those that return not, the reward they sought in the house of our Father. 
I ask also for a few moments of quiet meditation and the knowledge of the presence of God. May I never be the cause of one tear to fall, one heart to ache, one friend to lose. I ask for the patience to wait for the coming of these things, with the wisdom to know them when they come. And that is my New Year's wish for you.